to the women who say, I will not date a man unless he's rich, tall, abs, big eggplant, what you're actually saying is, I don't really think a man has much else to offer me. So if I'm going to put up with him, he at least needs to offer me those things. And I think that's just a really shallow way to live. Because those four things, rich, tall, abs, big eggplant, those are preferences. They're not priorities. They're not the non-negotiables. What are the non-negotiables? The non-negotiables that a man must have in order to date me, he's safe physically and emotionally. He's kind. He likes me and I like him. Like we like each other as a person and we're friends. He treats me as his equal. He has a passion for life. He's family oriented. He's a hard worker and ambitious. He's non-reactive and calm, not easy to anger. He's loyal. He's funny. He respects me. He's vulnerable and authentic. Now, all things being equal, if I had 100 men lined up in front of me who were all of my non-negotiables, kind, funny, respectful, then yeah, then I can pull in my preferences and say, he's tall, rich, big eggplant, all those things, great, I'll pick that one. But those are preferences, they're not priorities. I married a man and we became millionaires. Are we happy? No. He worked 12 hours a day, he traveled all the time, and by the time he got home and he was exhausted and he had no energy for his family. It was a lonely marriage. Do they need to be tall? I mean, not six foot, just taller than me, I guess. I look, look, I like to climb a mountain like anybody else, but I'd rather look up to him spiritually, physically, and emotionally. Does he have to have great abs? No. Listen, I dated a strongman competitor for a year and a half. He had, he was built like a freaking tree, amazing body, but he was not family oriented. He wasn't ambitious and he was codependent. So no. Do we like big eggplants? Yes, we like big eggplants. I dated a guy that had the biggest eggplant I've ever seen. It felt amazing. But that's all he had. That's all he had to offer. And ladies, if you got a man with a small eggplant, you go to the store and you buy him a sleeve extension and now you got a big eggplant. Done. Listen, ladies, you get mad when men say, I want a virgin who's short, who's fit, and who looks like a porn star. Yet you're doing the same thing. Character is the number one priority. The money and the appearance, those are just preferences.